Hello everyone, today I'm going to be making a shooting board. And I started off by cutting this base piece to a rough size, so it didn't really. I just kind of marked it out and kind of guessed what I thought would work nicely. Here I'm sawing it out, and this is actually not set up at all. I definitely want to sell that piece of wood that quickly. And after I did this, I uh, decided to glue up the piece on the top which is where the fence and the board that you're shooting or planning the end grain of sits. Having a little fun with editing here, because why not? Once I and once I glued up this board, this board was kinda hard to glue up because doing big joints like this is kinda challenging. So I started off by just clamping it off to the bench and then I added some heavy things to weight it down. Here I'm marking a straight line. So I have a straight surface, and using shocking compounds to make sure the plane slides smoothly, which actually re worked remarkably well. I know people normally use wax, but I, this is all I had, and it worked really well. So I cleaned up the edge. After that, I just found a little notch for all the sawdust and shavings and stuff to kind of escape away from the plane and not get caught up on the bottom part so the plane would run more smoothly. And then I marked a square line for the fence. And here you can see I'm kind of checking my square for square to make sure it's square. Because you want a fence to be square. And I enjoy saying the word square. Here I'm marking out the fence. And I'm marking out how long I want it to be, just roughly. I use cedar because it's a nice wood to work with. And it's kind of easy to replace if I ever need to. And it won't damage any wood that I'm thinking of. It was a little bit too thick so I kind of thinned it down here and made a nice flat surface to glue onto and screw onto and then I again marked so it would be square and then after this I marked four holes to drill for screws and I'm just drilling these out here I used a countersink bit and it actually worked quite well I don't normally use screws but I wanted it to be replaceable just in case so I decided to use screws on this occasion because they work pretty well here I'm checking it again for square, and this was a dowel that had a little bit of orange on the end of it, so I decided to clean it up and make it look all nice, and also try to use out my shooting board and see how it worked. It took a while to get it to work just right, but in the end it worked nicely, and it left a really quite nice surface finish on the board, because end grain is kind of tough, but it worked. So thank you all for liking, commenting, and subscribing. See you next time.